for the rebuttal, here's Richie Kessel. Thank you. First of all, let's hear it. The loudest table, most energetic, exciting table here. News 12 table. Why can't you be like that on the air? Okay. So, uh, I just, I wanted to say, and I, I wanted to start on a serious note. I hope you don't mind. But, um, as this press club show is going on, I'm sure many of you know that the Long Island Power Authority is having hearings to raise rates next year. And I don't have to tell you how sorry I feel about that. I really feel bad for Kevin Law, you know that. And I'm going to be quick so everyone can join me and go over there and kick the crap out of life, okay? Now, um, I want to also, I want to also say that a number of people couldn't make it tonight, and they asked me to explain to you why. So if you'll uh, give me a minute, I'd just like to say, Tom Squazzi would have liked to have been here tonight, but he's closing on a house in Chappaqua. <laughs> Howard Weissman wanted to be here tonight, but he's closing on a house in Glen Cove. <laughs> Dave Mejias, we don't want him here. Jim Dolan. I, I wanted to let you know I got a call from Jim this afternoon, um, and Jim was sorry to be here, but he's right now moving into Tim Knight's office over in Melbourne. <laughs> now, let me also indicate to you that um, Steve Israel couldn't be here tonight. He's just talking to anyone he can, begging for that Senate job. <laughs> Joe Mondello is at a party tonight. He's celebrating this year's election victories with the Democrats. <laughs> Finally, in a serious note, a friend of mine and all of ours, Joe Margiotta, couldn't be here tonight. He's in a much better place. I wanted to just say that. Great guy. Now, many of you know that um, I now have a new job. A year ago, I performed here, and I didn't have a job. And I couldn't work for a year. And uh, now I do have a job as head of the New York Power Authority. And a lot of people have asked me, how did you get that job? So I wanted to give you the top ten reasons why I got my job at the New York Power Authority. First, number ten, I asked Tim Knight, uh, uh, Jim Dolan, for their support. Nine, I haven't spoken before the Suffolk Legislature in over a year. Eight, Tom Swazi wouldn't hire me. <laughs> Seven, in with Bill Cunningham, out with Kevin Law. Six, I'm not appearing here tonight with Steve Levy. <laughs> Five, I refuse to patrol the Long Island Expressway. <laughs> I would be a sitting duck. Four, I promise not to hire anyone from anywhere at any time. <laughs> three. Uh-oh. I don't have three. Well, I'm going to have to make these up then. Three. <laughs> okay. You guys are cable vision. Where did you get all this energy from? Alcohol. The number one reason. The number one reason why I got my job at the New York Power Authority, I still don't know anything about electricity. <laughs> I, just wanted to, uh, I just wanted to end uh, in noting a couple of things. One, I, we all watched, we'll watched the press club, and I think we should all give them a round of applause for the great job they did this year. As usual, the skit about me sucked the most. <laughs> but I want to wish everyone a happy holiday. Uh, I think this is a great time. These are tough times right now. And uh, uh, I just want to ask you to do one thing uh, when you leave here tonight. Um, cancel your Newsday subscription. Thank you. Happy New Year, everyone.